Good afternoon. What's up? We're going RV hunting. Yes. Got a Texas back today. Hopefully we'll be picking something up today. Hopefully. Yeah, I'm dying. Not holding my breath. Yeah, we'll see. Yes. Going to Indianapolis. We're Woo. somewhere around there. So, uh, and so it begins. To be continued. Uh -huh. Well, com <coughs> coming to look. You have to uh, look carefully and consider. So uh, let me show you some of the things that we find challenging. So <clears throat> this is going to have to be resealed as well as the other side. It's a, uh, I think, I think it said a 2006. So it's in pretty good shape for a 2006. But um, we have mold in our current trailer. So we would really like not to have mold. And uh, we don't know how long it's been not sealed well. And then this damage here. There is sagging on the ceiling up here where uh, it goes with either the ceiling, like the lack of ceiling, or the damage. So we don't really know. And it's hard to tell. Is it water damage? Um, and water damage, mold, and the weather currently is going to make it hard to seal um, right away. So that's a big bummer. Day two, um, take two. Yesterday the trailer didn't work out very good. Uh, needed a bit more work than we thought it did. Um, and when we got inside, we're like, it's not that much room. The slide only popped out like a foot, and it was only for the uh, sofa big whoop so off we are to look at another one that yes. online appears to be much nicer and such so we'll see hopefully we're crossing our fingers hopefully we don't have to drive to detroit but... yeah that guy was kind of off too yeah the gentleman i spoke to that last night about this one we're gonna go look at he was much nicer he was <clears throat> i could hear it yeah so but off to lexington be. Nope. Nope. Let me turn it around so you can see the front of this trailer. And all I have to say is, um, pictures don't always tell the whole truth. Mm, yeah, not even close. <laughs> I was so disappointed that this didn't work out. So yeah. Um, has water damage. Hasn't been sealed in at least six years. Um... It, when we first pulled up, I was thinking, no. But at the same time, I was like, eh, it could just need a bath. But then we went up on the guy's porch and we saw this roof. And that was like a huge no. But then we walked inside and I went to the bedroom, master bedroom, and found two spots on the floor um, that had water damage. My foot sunk into the floor. I don't know what that's like because I almost went to the floor on an old one. <laughs> and then uh, a couple of walls inside the closets on either side of the master bedroom in the front uh, I could put my hand through the wall basically in a scene uh, of the paper <clears throat> and I could reach in and grab um, insulation it was it was wet and not good yeah so why don't you show them the picture show oh well this is what it looks like so there it is you can see Moss, angels, dust, whatever you want to say. There's the Hensley hitch. Uh, so promising. I really wanted the Hensley hitch. Yeah, they've had the slide up for who knows how long. And the roof looks... It's black. Like, yeah, you see this over here? Yeah, that's what the roof looks like. Except the roof should be white. Oh, brother. Goodbye, what I thought would be our future. Home. You're not worth my time. I went to a RV park, or not RV park, RV, RV dealer. Yeah. Northside RV Sales Center. So we saw one that could be promising. Mm -hmm. We'll see what happens with it. And uh, I guess we have a message into somebody else about a trailer, a different part of the state of Kentucky <laughs> uh, but we're waiting to hear back from them 
So we're getting a little bit more specific on our questions so that we don't waste so much gas driving places to see. So how do you feel about this, this one so far? Um, I'm kind of excited. Um, it's, I think it's got everything that we wanted besides it's in a foot longer than what we were wanting. Yeah, and it's <clears> Which, longer. I mean, what's a foot? <laughs> it has uh, a few things that more than we were wanting, like an outdoor kitchen. Yeah, it's got an outdoor kitchen, tons yeah. of storage, tons. Both front and back storage areas go straight across. Yeah. Like, and there's a ton of room in there. That's like, nice. I could crawl in and I'd be fine. The other thing is that our expedition, it can tow it, just not with a whole lot of anything stuff in it. <laughs> so, um, which we knew that would happen pretty much because um, a bigger trailer is heavier. Uh, so we had always planned on uh, going being Arizona, dry, dry going to Arizona. This our stuff in us. Yeah, which I think we'll still have to purge some stuff no matter what trailer we get. Just purge some things. If we're not going to use it, don't take it back to Arizona. I yep. think that is a life lesson. Mm -hmm. If you're not going to use it, if you don't use it, get rid of it. Absolutely. Why keep it? Especially in this life. Yeah. Not take it with you when you go, so why keep it? Let somebody else use it. So, we're going to go back to Indiana and uh, we'll see what happens. Mm -hmm.